And now on BBC One, Emmy Jones will be investigating the world of smoking. Over 7 billion people in the world, 6 million of those die each year just from smoking. Kills up to half of its users, putting your whole life at risk just for one cigarette, an addiction that in some cases is unstoppable. Hello and welcome to week one of The World Of with me, Emmy Jones. And today I'll be asking the question of, what is the truth about smoking? Later on in the show, specialist Stop Smoking advisor Molly May Cole tells us everything we need to know about the tobacco industry. But first, what's it like to be a smoker? I'm here with Kelly Lee, who hasn't smoked in the last 11 years. Is that correct? Yes. 12 years this year. Was it difficult to stop? No, not at all. Um, I got to the point where I was urging when I was smoking. Um, I wasn't smoking very much because I wasn't enjoying it anymore. What was your method? Cold turkey. My friend gave me some Nicorette tablet, um, chewing gum four days after, um, but I didn't start using those because I didn't want to rely on anything. How did you feel whilst you were a smoker and did your health improve after you stopped? I was obviously addicted to cigarettes, um, financially a bit better off, but then you always find something else to spend your money on. Um, and yeah, I wasn't coughing so much. Initially I was, but after that I wasn't. Smoking causes over 85% of lung cancer deaths, increases the chance of blood clots and makes it three times more likely to develop facial wrinkling. So why do people carry on doing it? I'm here with Molly Mae Cole to discuss the impacts of smoking and the effect it has on society. So why is smoking so addicting? Being exposed to nicotine completely alters the way your brain functions. When you smoke tobacco products, the nicotine is absorbed into your bloodstream and within just 10 seconds, it reaches your brain and releases adrenaline, provided that sense of buzz and pleasure and energy. So what makes it so dangerous? Tobacco smoke contains over 4,000 incredibly harmful chemicals. These chemicals affect the reproductive system, sexual organs, pregnancy in women and sperm count in men. People are prone to addiction after just one cigarette. So what have authorities done to prevent this? A law was recently introduced in October 2015 which states that it is illegal to smoke in a car with a passenger aged under 18. This is an effective law, however the tobacco industry is becoming more commercially successful each year for the completely wrong reasons. Consumer spending on tobacco products in 2012 amounted to an estimated 15.1 billion. So are you saying the government are prioritising profit over innocent lives? Absolutely. Something needs to be done. The tobacco industry profit is rising substantially each year and affects our society as a whole. It can also cause health defects such as lung cancer, serious physical aging, and it differs our moral values. Quitting smoking is possible with determination and support. There are many alternative coping mechanisms that are much better than smoking. If you've been affected by any of the issues raised, you can contact the NHS Smoking Helpline on 0800 022 4332.